In this video, I'll share my experience after using both Wix and Lovable to build actual websites. I'm not talking theory. I used them, ran tests, built client pages, and here's what I found out. Let's start with Wix. It's super popular for a reason. The classic Wix editor is fast and simple. You just drag, drop, publish. It's great for beginners. But when you need more control, Wix Studio is where it gets interesting. You can design responsively, adjust breakpoints, build advanced layouts, and collaborate with teams. You still can't access the raw code like you can in Webflow, but Studio gives you serious creative flexibility without needing to touch code. Performance-wise, Wix sites are fast. They're hosted on AWS, backed by a global CDN, and load times were solid in my testing. Images optimized right, pages load quickly, SEO tools have also improved. You can edit URLs, meta tags, alt text, add structured data. It's a lot more search friendly than it used to be. Wix pricing starts at $16 per month for basic sites. If you're building an online store, the e-commerce plans go from $27 to $59 per month. Studio plans cost more, but you get pro features like team permissions, custom design systems, and more granular control over layouts. Now, let's talk about Lovable. It's way simpler. It's made for people who don't want to deal with design systems or any real complexity. You log in, pick a clean template, and you're pretty much done. The UI is super friendly, perfect for non-techies or anyone launching a quick portfolio or personal site. But the trade-off is obvious. Design customization is limited. You can't tweak spacing, padding, or breakpoints the way you can in Wix Studio. No custom code support. Interactions and animations, very basic. It's made to be easy, not powerful. Lovable's hosting is built in, but not as fast as Wix. I ran speed tests and it was a bit slower, especially on image heavy pages. SEO tools are minimal. You get basic meta tag editing, but no control over schema, no automated sitemaps, and URLs are locked into their default structure. Pricing is more affordable though. Free plan is there, then $10 a month for standard, $25 for pro, and $35 for business. It's enough for small projects, but you'll hit limitations fast if you want to scale or stand out. So here's my honest take. Wix, especially with Studio, is miles ahead in flexibility, performance, and SEO. I could build client-level sites that feel custom and still hit great load times and search rankings. Lovable is fine if you just want to get online fast and don't care about deep customization. If you actually want your site to grow with your business or you're working with real design needs, go with Wix. Lovable's cool for quick, simple sites, but that's where it stops.